Hello everybody, my name is Demaquan, and welcome back to more Minish Cap. So, last time we left off, we just completed the Deepwood Shrine, where we had to fight a giant choo-choo as the boss, and we got the Earth Element, so let's go back and tell the Elder. Rolling. Hey, Pastari. So, yeah, I don't remember voices. So, you have found the earth element. You are blessed with much courage and strength for one so young. If you can, if your conviction holds strong, head to Mount Cornell. There you will find a man named Malari. Among all the Minish, there is no one more able to repair your sword. If you ask him, I am certain he will reforge your broken pickery blade. I shall send word to him in advance. Travel safely. You are brave, but there are many evils now in the world. Abra! Kadera! Leave through this door here. It will take you out of the forest quickly. Great Elder, we are in your debt. We shall head for Mount Cornell at once. Yeah, I don't think I actually gave Ezla an actual voice. I can't remember, it's been so long since I last recorded! Green clothes? And a mystical hat? Sir! Would you by chance be linked to the one who found the Earth Element? Surely you are! I've heard so many tales about you. I am Bellari, researcher of antiquities. I am also, well, a bit of an inventor. You know, you won't be able to get back to town due to all the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. You got a bomb bag, and it has ten bombs in it. Now you can blow up lots of stuff. <laughs> Set that to my A. Chop that. Woo, money. Money, 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 money. Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of wind. Hmm? Whoa, it blew up? Hey kid, look at where that stone marker used to be. There's some strange symbol on the ground. Yes, of course. Why, this must be... Well, I have it the foggiest, to be honest. Hmm. Yeah, you're a great help, Ezlo. Ah. Yeah. Bomb action. Fire in the hole! Oh. Every other time I played, when I blew up those rocks, there was at least a few rupees. Up, oh, beetle. Uh. Chopping up all the grass. Nothing. What's over here? Bomb. That's one way to deal with the enemy, right? Shrink down and poof, they're gone. Hey, look at this kinstone piece. Have you ever seen one like this? What? You don't know what a kinstone piece is? Well, tell you what. Well, don't you come back and see me when you get one, okay? Sorry. Those are a little bit stuffy. Blech. Gross. So gross. Bomb this. Boom. Stupid keys. You got 20 mysterious shells. Ooh, 20. What? 
P hat, P hat, P hat. Uh, I forgot how to fight him for a minute. Oh! <laughs> Tuck the other out by shooting his buddy at him. I'm a monster. You're a monster. I'm not a monster, you are. Yes, I just started reciting Shrek. I'm sorry. I'm a goober. Okay, we got a shortcut. Just mash the button. You got five bombs. Store them in your bomb bag. Okay. Eh, stuffy nose, stuffy nose. Ugh. Look, I made it back home. And I'm not going in. <laughs> Sorry, Grandpa, I don't want to see you right now. I'm still adventuring. Huh? Come on, come on. See how many kinstone pieces you can collect. You never know what fusing kinstones will do, but it's sure to be good. Come on up and get your free kinstone bag for holding your kinstone pieces. Don't miss out on this incredible once in a lifetime opportunity. Yes, yes, you're here for your free kinstone bag, aren't you? That's right, maybe you didn't hear me, but they're free for all kids right now. You got a kinstone bag, you can now carry kinstone pieces with you. First start to view its contents from the quest status screen. Fitting two kinstone pieces together is called kinstone fusion. If you get two pieces to fit perfectly, great happiness will come your way. I'll put a kinstone piece in your kinstone bag so you can give it a try. Anyone who's ready and willing to fuse kinstones will look like I do right now. So, a pumpkin headed weirdy? <laughs> will you see that look? in their eyes, that's when you press L. Use the well, control pad to choose a in stone piece and press A to try using it. Did you catch all that? Yes. Then stand in front of me and press the L so we can choose kin stones. Yes, yes, that's it. Press L. Now you can use now you then you can see the kinstone screen. No, oh, I can't speak. There you go, hurdy gurdy man. The two kinstone pieces fit perfectly. Maybe something good will happen. I know where that is. That's down by my house. And it even shows it on the map. A perfect fit. That means we're both due for a little happiness. See ya! You got a piece of heart. Collect for to make a new heart container for for even for even more life energy. Uh, I can't speak. I swear, I swear I can read. I'm not illiterate. Come down here. In here. I am Swiftblade, finest swordsman in all of Hyrule. If you train with me, I guarantee that you will increase your skill dramatically. So, would you like to train here? Please. We shall start with the most basic of all techniques. I shall teach you the spin attack! First, 
Press and hold your sword button. Second, build up enough power. Third, release your destructive might. That's all, young swordsman. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Aha, very good. You are a very quick student. But one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body so as to demonstrate the technique. I call this the swift blade possession technique of training. Watch this. Bo Se Sean You now you must try it yourself. First and hold your sword button. Build up enough power. Then release your destructive might. That's all there is to it. Yes, fine work. You are a quick study. I will now give you this tiger scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can reveal it with this scroll. You may view it any time from the quest status screen. You learn the secret spin attack fighting technique. This is the first sword technique you can learn from Master Swiftblade. So now I got my spin attack. Up here. Past the, these shops. Hi, postman. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Ho, ho! So you learned the spin attack? It's still dangerous, but maybe you can handle it. Well, let's see how you do. Show me that spin attack. Okay. Yeah, that's the one. But there are monsters out there, kid. You just make sure you're careful. Kirby Highlands? A foxy bandito! You give me a blue rupee. Roll. Down, down. This way. Bomb. Um, whoops, shield, roll, come on, oh, I'm too close, Ouchie. okay, you got me, let me make it up to you, you can have this most elects of all bottles for only 20 rupees, so what do you say, huh, sure, you got an empty bottle, use it to store all sorts of things. Thanks a lot! Okay, there's four. I needed a recount. I forgot how many there are in this game. Blow that up. And I'm gonna want that. Scoop. You put water in your bottle. Sprinkle it on different things. Like mm, this bean sprout. Nope. I thought that would actually work. You put water in your bottle. Sprinkle it on different things. Okay. Uh, shield or bombs? Shield or bombs? Uh, I think bombs are more useful on the mountain. 20! Oh! We got this wee. Boom! Okay, you got me! I'll make it up to you by telling you something good. A friend of mine... In a cave just east of here in Chili Highlands has an item. If you're planning on going up Mount Cornell, I think you might need it. It won't get you to the top, but it might just give you a start. He's talking about the buff. Dude, we just got the bottle from. Roll. Tech tight. Tech tight is dead tight. Okay, that actually did not sound good when I said dead thing. <laughs> that could be taken out of context. 
And I know we can't take the fairy in the bottle right now because we're gonna need it. We're gonna need the bottle. You did. <laughs> you got it. Moitered. Hey, we kinda need the bombs up there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm fighting like a goober. Plug your ears. Okay, we're good. Shrink me down as no. Ouch. My foot hurts! So, this perfectly look normal looking stone was another portal to the Minish world. There may be other rock portals. Keep your eyes peeled, boy. Don't call me boy. Who the heck do you think you are, Kratos? I ain't no Atreus. Boy. Boy. I can't do the voice. Eh. <clears throat> Just clear my throat. <clears throat> Boy. Eh. Still not good enough. You guys just don't die easy. And... Whoops. Get rid of the water. You put Mount Cornell mineral water in your bottle. It's piping hot. Piping hot. So you mean I could burn myself? <laughs> mm, burn myself. Please don't burn yourself. So, I don't feel like I need to warn you guys not to burn yourself. But still, don't burn yourself. I've been burnt several times. It hurts. Heck, I got burned by a freaking weld. Oops. <laughs> I should have let go of the R button. I'm an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, you got me. I'll make it up to you by selling you bombs. Ten of them for 30 rupees. So, what do you say, huh? Well, we're getting a little low on bombs. You bought ten bombs for them in your bomb bag. Thanks a lot. Uh... You know what? Let's take the guts chair. Whoops. Yeah, we can do that. Bye, suckers! Just suck them up. Dead Helmasaur. Once you've pulled off their iron masks, these guys are no trouble whatsoever. Oh no duh, I just learned that when I ripped their mask clean off. Whoops. Boom. And we're actually going to call it a wrap here. And we're like, what, not even halfway up the mountain? <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like. 
subscribe for more co quality content from yours truly. And, as always, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!